When it comes to trees, San Francisco is a city of contrasts. While some neighborhoods have lush green foliage, others have very few trees. This unequal distribution of trees is called tree inequity. To understand tree inequity, let's look at the history of San Francisco. Historically, San Francisco's landscape was mostly sand dunes and wetlands. Most of the trees in the city today were planted by humans, but where they were planted was shaped by systemic racism, particularly through redlining. Redlining was a discriminatory practice in the 1930s that categorized neighborhoods based on their racial makeup. Areas with predominantly non-white residents were redlined and given the lowest ratings. Redlined neighborhoods faced disinvestment and neglect. The legacy of redlining continues to affect communities today, resulting in a lack of resources in all public services, including green spaces and trees. Recognizing this, San Francisco decided to take steps to address the issue and promote an equitable distribution of trees. In 2016, Friends of the Urban Forest worked with allies to pass the Healthy Trees and Safe Sidewalks ballot initiative. This ballot initiative transferred the responsibility of watering, maintenance, and liability of street trees and sidewalks from residents to the city. And they even set aside funding for this purpose. It passed with 79% support from voters. To implement this ballot initiative, San Francisco Public Works created the Street Tree SF program which is supported by 19 million annually. Street Tree SF ensures that street trees throughout the city receive regular watering and maintenance, including pruning and disease management to help them thrive. Friends of the Urban Forest plants trees in low canopy neighborhoods for free with the help from volunteers. By working together, we can overcome the legacy of systemic racism and ensure that every neighborhood in San Francisco enjoys the benefits of a thriving urban forest. Let's create a more beautiful, inclusive, and climate-resilient San Francisco.